So we have the glenoid cavity, the lateral border, the coracoid process, the acromion. This is the anterior view of the scapula, so we're going to have the subscapular fossa in here. Then we're going to have the inferior angle at the bottom, superior angle at the top. If you flip it to the posterior side, you have the infraspinous fossa and then supraspinous fossa above the spine. This is the scapular spine right here. So supraspinous process, so, sorry, supraspinous fossa, fossa, supraspinous fossa, infraspinous fossa, and inferior angle like I said earlier. And remember this is lateral because the glenoid cavity has to be lateral because it meets, it articulates with the head of the humerus to make the armpit. And this is the medial border. And that's it.